We're going to show you how to do uh, or to use a visual le logic on two points. The first is a length, length, and the second is um, let's go to the first visual logic. Okay, so to test the skew length, so the second is to count the number of process units using variables. So we have the starting point, and I'm gonna do it like really easy one activity and end. So, and so if that key it has, for example, more than so, so it will send them out of the system. How to do this? All what you need to do is to create a label. So how you create it is the easiest way is that and rule label. Okay, call it router for example. And so we add the starting point and the value is fixed value to one. Okay. And so and the routing out, so it will be if it is Based on priority, no, we want it based on the label. So it's router, router. So if it is one, it goes straight into the system. If it is two, it goes into the end out of it. Okay. But by default, because again, as an action, we set them all as one. So if you run the system, just one second, please. So if you run the system and you say you want to run it for 250 minutes and so we run it so by default everything is gonna go out of the system as you could see here literally all of them so I'm gonna reset this I'm gonna make this like really big value and we're gonna send one to the system at a faster rate so if you run it again and so there's like a huge key so if i make this like back to five and we run it again still there's a key that's better than before okay the key has no capacity so like you're literally 62 stuck in the queue so let's do it in a way just if we have more than 15 and the key they head out to and two okay Right. so this is key for activity one so what I have to do or what we have to do is rooting out again we set the label as equal to one which is router and we said if it is based on that router if it is equal to one or equal to two okay so we we need an action here so action visual logic and if condition and this is like really easy so you need the objects in the system so q for activity double click if q for activity okay dot count contents is it greater than or equal to for example, 10, add them out, okay? And here, so set, you don't have to remember anything, click on nothing, so all there, you literally don't have to remember anything. So that value here is equal to, all I have to remember is that router equal to, which means, uh, and you can add command, sorry, comment, okay? So this is, my command and okay perfect 
So I'm gonna close this, say okay. And all I have to remember is the following. So when router equal to, all I have to remember is the following. So when router equal to, okay. If it is equal to one, key for activity. If equal to it, head out of the system. So if you run it again, so whenever we have, what value did you put 10? So it heads out of the system, okay? So if you use your logic, if you put that value to 20, Visual logic is really easy. It's like all the comments is there. You just have to remember them, like how to, which one to, to use. So now when they are 20, they head out of the system. Okay. So so I'm gonna save it into the desktop. That's one. Okay. So the next point would be count how many activities processing. So we need to create a variable number served as a value. And if you click on number, you should see it here, number served. Again, you need to remember how it's been spelled. So control copy, close. So if you go to the activity, again, it's really, really easy. So we have if visual logic, we don't want this one. So if we say action, root out, rooting out, sorry, and we have more. So on work complete before exit, on exit. Okay, so I want it on work complete. So if, a value here, so we need distribution, label, spreadsheet, other global data simulation time is greater than warmer period. Well, in our case, it's like it's literally equal to zero. So set a value of literally so easy. So it's just like so easy. So we need the mass function as a global variable number served. So number served equal number served because I remember how it's written. I did like copy paste plus one and and close. Okay, so I'm gonna if I go to data and rules information center. So number of served add to KPIs. If I run this. and if I click the result manager so we have number 51 if we do run the trial trial calculator so number served to be able to tell which one we need so we need 7 so if we do trial setup run trial so we have those values between 46 so it's like 95% confident in TV so trial setup here we need so for example 30,000 I did a video in the playlist just check it so run trial sorry 33,000 so apply trial setup run trial and 47 and 51 okay so if you want a copy of this video please let me know